of the walls and try to get a good line well, that's of That's what shot. I mean. Like, we could see it from outside, couldn't we? Because you said we saw a white Yeah, you could see it from outside, outside yes. Yeah. It's going to be a long shot, but I'll try. So, all right. Let's I, try I have an idea. idea. I have an idea. What if we pry the orb loose and hurl it at the barracks? Um, we Throwing the orb itself. Explosion and probably die. Well, how... Because the, these things have 50, pretty massive range, don't they? 50, 50 foot radius. Yeah, is, is this another... Radius, well, the guy, what you saw before was a 50 foot radius from the tower. Oh. Yeah. So 50 foot radius... Plus two, three, four, five, six, so about six. eighty foot radius. About an eighty between eighty and hundred feet. Yeah. Let's just go ahead and not do that. Yeah. Let's just unhook this thing as much as we can and take it out from afar. <laughs> I'm imagining like getting a catapult set up to throw this. All thing. right. <laughs> I got my I get my crowbar out again, and okay. I'm uh, going to try some strength checks to try to disconnect right, or loosen it from the uh, from its yeah. support. So, all right. Twenty-three. Yeah, the uh, the supports come loose, and uh, the orb hangs precariously above. All right, get the fuck Sto out of here. Stow yeah. away the uh, crowbar and jog out with the rest of the party. Okay. Do, 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 do. Uh, guys, where are you? <laughs> Denora's still in the corner. Guys, <laughs> the orb, Denora, everything will be okay. Rush around outside. I hope this works. So I'm gonna get. This is going to be a fun shot. Oh, damn it. All right. We'll measure out to where this thing could be here. I stand there and look at it. It's like, well, I could, I could probably hit without any disadvantage. Okay. Okay. Line up shot. 30. Oh, oh great. Great. Yeah, 20. You smack the orb. And as you smack the orb, you notice something interesting. Uh, one of the demons has walked outside, and he is uh, patrolling the... Uh, He's patrolling the wall, and just as the orb is about to hit, he notices that the or uh, just as the arrow is about to hit the orb, he notices and looks up and sees the arrow hit the orb, and he screams out in common, But I just had my lunch today! <laughs> <laughs> the orb comes crashing down, he's engulfed in a pillar of fire. <laughs> uh, that's a, that, quick, that is quick, a very quick, everybody, turn around and walk away without looking back. <laughs> I, I, I walk without looking at the explosion. Still holding the arrow, the bow. It's like, yeah, that's right. I crit on that. Seriously, like right now, I'm like fucking fist pumping. We're hardcore, man. We just fucking tore that place apart. <laughs> it's an epic encounter. That's that's how that's how the toothpick brigade does it. <laughs> Hold on, I need, I, need, I need to get sweet victory playing. Hold on. <laughs> sweet victory. Yeah. Uh, just had my lunch today. <laughs> All right. Well, we should go report back to the Pierre. Well, I think Maybe. we should wait for a moment and watch to see what happens in the, to the barracks and otherwise and see how they respond. Uh, I think yeah, we how should much, have lunch. How, how much, like, what does the facility look like after the explosion? I'll show you. Oh, oh, the, well, the left side of it's gonna go. <laughs> 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 oh. it's, uh, it's kind of fucked up. The, the blast has, uh, you see demon uh, bodies just strewn about. Uh, and uh, a fully half, uh, almost half of the, uh, almost half of the thing is, uh, Pretty much wiped out from that. That was a significantly more powerful orb than you uh, that you first had uh, spotted. Okay. Um, right. As you walk back towards the towards the camp, the the guys are cheering. Um, the chanting uh, uh, toothpick brigade. Toothpick. Brigade. <laughs> <laughs> I was looking around like what? Uh, we have stick. We have found our order of stick. Uh. <laughs> as you. As you walk I'm back, I mean, guys, yeah, fuck yeah. yeah. <laughs> As you come back, uh, Commander Lapierre comes up to you and says, "This is truly, truly an auspicious day. Uh, Red Wolf will sing the praises of the Toothpick Brigade for years to come." We, do we have to be called that? Yes, it's kind of yes. <laughs> Dother, it's hardcore, man. I'm gonna start air guitaring. Um, he quickly shakes your hands, and with that, he yells at his men, and he goes, ATTACK! 
and uh, the brigade is uh, uh, the the rest of the tower is just absolutely under siege by pretty much every man that was stationed there. Uh, they run forward and slay whatever's left there, uh, almost as if it's a celebratory massacre, if, if you will. Wow, they they seem to be really enjoying this. Hmm. And uh, uh, well, I mean, it's you know. I know. I was just saying, like, wow, they have a lot of fun with this. Good for them. Good for them. Hmm. Uh, sort of left standing there at the camp, just going. Huh? Yeah. We're like, yeah, I'm still high fiving people. Like, yeah. High five people in the party. Dother, Dother, come on, come on, Dother, come on. We haven't won the war yet. Come on. No. Come on. <clears throat> John! High five. Yes! <laughs> I'm just going to start Dother. head banging. <laughs> uh, Dother, do you think we should report back to the town before we do anything else, or should we just move on from here? I don't think that they need our input. Quite. <laughs> I, wonder how the, I wonder how they would react if they knew who, <laughs> who, was, who was involved in this. But, so, uh, do you high five on go or on one? <laughs> There's never a wrong time to high five. <laughs> That's Doll's motto. All right, so you've destroyed uh, you destroyed a tower that was under siege by men. Uh, congratulations for a long time there. We probably um, warned somebody about the blue squishy orb. <laughs> probably should have done that. Uh, we, we, should walk the, we can walk over there. To I think that we should investigate what's left here. Make yeah. sure there's no working teleport devices left. Exactly. I would like to state for the record, I had a Hobgoblin Warcaster and uh, five other Mesodemons for you to face. Mm -hmm. But fully, every single time you snuck by the middle compound, they failed on their plus 20 perception checks. <laughs> Yay! I crit failed Every single fucking time. <laughs> Look, man, when you're eating lunch, <laughs> you don't notice these things. I just had my lunch today. Oh, God. Oh, uh, man. Uh, so you guys are going to head back and, and expect things? Yeah, I think so. Uh, where are we heading back to? Are we heading back to Red Wolf or... we no, back to the, the tower. Tower area. Okay. Once the slaughter is over. Okay. Uh, yeah, it, it, pretty much everything else has been taken care of, and uh, it, it's a pretty quick slaughter. Um, they uh, they pretty much take care of everything, and now they're trying to get everything else in, into order and investigate the remainder of the, the building. And uh, they have a special uh, team dedicated to looking at the blue orb and wondering what the fuck it is. It's good. It's a team yeah. dedicated to just looking at it, scratching its head, going, "Well, it's a thing." <laughs> <laughs> Um, you investigate the remainder of, of what, what's left. Uh, you notice that this particular orb has uh, incinerated what, what ground it was on. Uh, whatever, whatever orb was here, it was, its power was significantly enhanced compared to the powers of, of uh, the North and South Towers. Um, you this look one around, was more important. What's that? This one was more important. Well, maybe. Or longer established, yes. Uh, you also notice that uh, pretty much everything has been scorched beyond recognition. Whatever equipment was in the barracks, uh, it's pretty much useless at this point. The only thing you can find are some rations that may last you that would last you a couple of days. Uh, uh, you can use those. Beyond Have lunch. That, <laughs> I think it's time that we have dinner today now. Uh, beyond that, there really isn't much left of the uh, of the the fortress. Uh, so we don't find a teleportation device. Well, you found um, what appears to be the entrance to a uh, to a basement in the um, in the barracks, but it's it's beyond help at that point. Yeah. All right then. Well, it's probably been destroyed, and if not, they're probably not gonna be able to get out of there. Okay. okay. Well. Mm -hmm. Um. Good. Good job, guys. Yes. <laughs> High five. No. 
I, high my hands, I, well, no, Dalt's hands like shaking, like high five, man. Dalt, I'm not going to celebrate until this whole thing's over. You have to so, do baby dance. Celebratory ass slaps. Especially not that. John, no, be quiet. <laughs> Don's just coming after him. <laughs> I don't need your consent. <laughs> John, this is grime. Okay. Well, so, let's might, do lunch. Well, we might well we might want to return to Red Wolf. We might be able to get some sort of reimbursement or supplies from there and then advance further to somewhere else. It takes a week to get back to uh, Red Wolf though. That is true. We don't but have much. That's time. where the boat is. But that is where uh, it's where the mighty gauntlet is. Right. I mean, uh, do, I'm going so to have... check the I'm going to check the uh extra map that we were given. Mm-hmm. Uh, by the uh, mysterious visitor, and I'm going to try and determine how far away we are from the last X. Uh, yeah, I can tell you that. You are roughly... You'll, you'll be traveling over desert, uh, really harsh terrain, um, and it is... Did I close that? I did. Excuse me. Let me get this back up. It is a good six days by uh, walking uh, through the desert. You take it to take the entire week back. And just... do you I, don't think think we... I don't think we have the time to head back. But do you think we're supplied enough to handle the terrain of the desert? We can ask the army for additional supplies. They're probably going to be heading back to Red Wolf already, so if they have any extras, they'd probably be fine to give them to us. Mm-hmm. Well, but I we suppose are... we should talk with Commander Wayne Lapierre. Commander Lapierre. Uh, you go up to Lapierre, and he says, Ah, it's the heroes of Red Wolf. How can I help you? Well, I think our work isn't quite done yet. We have, we have to trek further and make another assault. So at this point, I th- think if there's any supplies or rations you can spare for us, that would be most appreciated. Uh, supplies. Well, we do have, uh, we are dwindling on supplies. We were making a, uh, a caravan back to Red Wolf for more, but, uh, I'll, I'll see what we could do. We could give you, uh, perhaps each week, uh, a week's worth of rations, uh, if that might help. Um, in terms of water, we're, we're running quite low ourselves. Uh, we need to get fresh water from Red Wolf and have it shipped here. But there is, uh, there is a, a small tributary that runs, uh, just to the north of here. It's about a day's, uh, day's worth away. You can, uh, you can fill up on the water there. Although, I'll give you a warning: if you're not very, if you're not very strong gutted, uh, you may find that you get the shits for a few days. I think that that'd be preferable than dying of. Uh, what's that Th- word? Thirst? thirst. Not the not that one. The the longer one. Dehydration. Dehydration. Yeah. That one is it. It's the same thing. <laughs> yeah, but I wanted to sound fancier, and then I forgot how. <laughs> so it just looks like a big idiot. Thanks for pointing it out even further. Well, <laughs> I'm an asshole. Oh, no, you're just silly. Yeah, I'm both. Okay. Um, <laughs> I wonder if there's anything else you know. We're going to travel across the desert. <laughs> oh, you're going to travel across the desert? Whew. What, what brings you through that hellish plane? Well, the last of the Demon Baron's towers, aside from the main one. I see. Uh, well, I I could wish you luck. You know, if you want to take, if you don't want to take the direct route, um, this land actually used to be well, this land used to be forest and plains. It used to never be desert. Um, if you want to spend an extra maybe three days travel, you can head to the north. There's a still forest uh, yet to the north, uh, just south of the Great Divide. Uh, head west from there, and the trek should be a little easier. But uh, you'll still have to head south through the desert for about a day or so. Oh. That's preferable to several days. Mm -hmm. I'll follow whatever you decide. Yeah, um, so the... um, Now, Jason, I'm assuming Mm -hmm. from the way that the map pointed it out that the last tower, is it like somewhere... On the yeah, west look, coast look at of the area. Uh, can you go to the overworld map and I'll show you? I'm on it. Yes. Okay. 
Uh, it's right where it, the X is uh, right here where the road ends. 